I think for us to have something that commemorates 9-11 is huge. Um, as we know, you know, history and time passes and people forget the magnitude of things that occurred. By having this, we will always be able to uh, look at it, touch it, feel it, and remember the horror of that day so that we are never, you know, it never leaves us and that we always move forward from it. I feel proud that we can have an art artifact like this from an event like that, um, like 9-11. I was thinking of where could it be displayed where it would have the most, not necessarily memorial impact, because there's a lot of those around but maybe the most educational impact in, in the county. There's one thing about putting it in front of a firehouse and a rescue squad and the rest, but in terms of reaching uh, the people, reaching the future of people who will come, uh, this made a greater sense to them. I thought if we brought it on campus in some fashion, um, it would probably be a way for the greatest number of people to reflect and appreciate what this piece of steel meant. It's, it's really priceless when you realize the enormity of it state, as a statement of history. It's very rare that I have an opportunity to teach my students about something um, and then actually have them touch an artifact from it. I think any of the senses who can touch this and feel it and get a, a feel for it, that helps them to recognize its reality. Think of it in terms of in five, ten, twenty generations from now, of people who come through here. Each of them have an opportunity by having it here to share it with others, to let them understand it, to get a sense of it. It was really a, a wonderful opportunity that we immediately sought to uh, have come to fruition. Um, and the, through the kindness of, uh, of Bob and the, and the rest of the committee, we were able to get it. And uh, we're looking forward to having it prominently displayed throughout our campus. 9-11 World Trade Center Artifact. The forces and causes that struck, bent, and drove this hardened steel I-beam down from its high purpose within the World Trade Center in New York City on September 11, 2001, have delivered before you and before the future people of our world a symbol that one may touch and ring and consider. To consider those who died that day, those who were from the moment hence irreparably harmed, and those who even today are yet shaken as a result. Now, this I-beam's higher purpose is to serve as a witness to ring out to all who might stand before it, that the event happened, that this very steel holds in the sounds, the heat, the smoke, the lost people, and that now perhaps you may remember them kindly through the measure and touch of your own life.